Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today's video, the Unibuilds A350 and Autoland. So prior to entering the uh, approach data into the aeroplane, what you're going to want to do is locate your Cat 3 ILS charts into Manchester here, 2, 3 right. Cat 3B at the bottom has no decision height. Because in an earlier tutorial I've executed a missed approach, I have to put a value in. And therefore I've put in 100 feet because it will not let me put 50 feet in for a decision height. So just work with what you can get. and. Uh, you will fly the ILS effectively like any other approach, however we will leave autopilot 1 and 2 on and when we do arrive, uh, making sure all the missed approach data is correct, we should have autopilot 1 and 2 as we establish land 3 dual, lock and glide slope are obviously active currently because we're short final now and we've got auto brake, brake to vacate, armed, ready to go. As we get closer now to final approach, because we fly the ILS like normal, gear down at the right time, flaps extended at the right time. 400. We'll get the countdown and we can see land is now active. In a moment flare will become armed and rollout will then become armed as we start to flare. And we keep the autopilot on all the way through this approach until we hear the retard call out. Monitoring everything all the way down. Continue. In reality this would be very low visibility but 50, we should see the runway 40, with 75 meters RVR. Flares 30, active, throttle idle. 20, 10, reverse arms. So what we're doing is doing reverse left and right green manually. Brake to bake tape is active and roll out as the active mode. You'll notice autopilot still engaged, the aircraft is keeping itself on the center line. We can zoom in to prepare our brake to vacate functions. And that is it. Auto land in the Innerbelds A350 for Microsoft Flight Simulator. Hope you've enjoyed it, found it useful, nice, simple, keeping it all to the basics. Hit like, hit subscribe. The only other thing to point out is through 60 knots, close your reverses. You can also uh, dab the brakes as you go below sort of 30 knots if you want to revert to manual brakes and disarm the brake to vacate function. And then when you're ready, you can just disarm the autopilot and head off the runway. Do all of your after landing checks. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you next time. If you haven't done so already, check out all of my other A350 tutorials. See ya!